Okay guys, I've got to make this little quick video clip for the people that might be a little bit confused about the competition. Now the way to actually enter it, I'll just show you on my television. Okay, there we go. Okay, now this is where we're at. Okay, so that's the video that you get, you guys get to watch. Okay, now you have to scroll down and make a comment there. Okay, this is actually your entry. This here in the comments, which I won't be um, answering any of them. Um, because just in case I don't want to stuff something up. Okay, so under this video, you have to make a comment because YouTube gets to pick. It's called the comment, um, yeah, YouTube comment picker. Okay, and the picker will pick out of these comments who the winners are. Okay, so that is super important. Facebook is not as important. I just want guys to go on it. But um, this is the one that pays. This is the one that is the competition. You know, you got to put your name under here. Okay, in the comments. And, you know, you have to be subscribed. Okay, otherwise the comment picker won't pick you. That's about it. Okay, I hope you understood that and made it a little bit easier for the guys that haven't got it right. Okay, good luck. Here we go again, guys. Okay. Um, again, I did uh, 11 wheelbarrows. This has only just started. Um, 11 wheelbarrows through this plant takes about 35 minutes. And she's finished. As you can see here. And over here. Now I have got in here a submersible pump. Okay, and she pumps out 21,000 litres an hour. Okay, just thought I'd mention that. And then under there is the spigot and can you see how bent the pipe is well that limits the water coming back out and that's it here and there's Keith <laughs> and that's the plant and then uh, you can see the rubbish over this side okay I cleaned out the mud yesterday refilled it so that's why it's muddy there. Yeah, she's going nice and sweet. Everything's working fine. I'm back filling in this area over here with rock and crap. <coughs> that's where I dug all the zircons and so forth out. But I've still got an area over there, I think. I'm not 100% sure. I think I spread it out out the front. But anyhow, we'll find out one day. I'll dig it up process it and we'll see how it goes okay um should be back in half an hour till then by for now okay the wash is done okay uh, back in a sec okay here we go Time to clean it out.
Okay. Moment of truth. Glasses. Okay, it's a sapphire. Ugly as, but it's a dud. I wasn't too impressed about this dig. Didn't look anything special, okay. There's a sapphire right there. It's not any quality or anything. And here is a spinel. Sapphire, a little blue. Okay, we'll have a look at this. Should have been 20 carat, but anyhow, that is a nice blue. Should have, would have, could have, but didn't. <laughs> okay, another little dud. Big spinel, blackjack, people call it. She's black. Little tiny blue. There's a dud, sapphire dud, uh, another big uh, spinel. A little tiny sapphire dud. Another sapphire dud. Spinel. Little pieces of spinel. Little sapphire. Another sapphire dud. Spinel. Little clear sapphire, but it's um 
flat as a pancake. There's another one. Another little clear sapphire. You know? Spin out again. Okay. Well, definitely didn't get nothing big and blue today. That's a little sapphire. There's another sapphire dud. And another little sapphire dud. And another little sapphire dud. You know, and that is it. Job done. Again, that was the 11 wheelbarrows, so actually, not too bad, it just didn't get anything special. A few little ones that are clear, and um, we'll have a look inside. Bye for now. Okay, today's wash, whoops, uh, 11 wheelbarrows again, and total of 54 carats. Okay. I've gone down the hill. I'll be right back uh, once I go through. Okay, here we go. Grand total. 18 carats. Yeah, pretty poor. Um, yeah, what can I say? Poor. Okay, I'll be back with the other camera to show you the quality of these. Bye. Okay, here we go. Now, I'll show you guys. Oh, let's have a look. There it is. There's one of the stones. Okay, you can, you can see how hazy it is inside. Whoa, come on. What's going on? Yeah, inside that stone. Looks like potch of an opal, doesn't it? Actually. But yeah, so that's that. That's that sapphire. Then we got the flat one, which is of course nice and clear. Look how flat it is. Yeah. That's that one there. This is a pretty little blue there. That is gorgeous color okay and the rest are just little tiny ones whoa yeah I don't know why the camera's playing around okay those ones need heat treatment And that's that. Not a crash hot um, day, but still, it's still sapphire. Anyhow, that's it. 
All right, guys. Um, like, share, subscribe, and hello again to uh, the new subscribers. G'day, you've got a whole batch of them in the last couple of days. Thank you. And um, God bless, and we shall see you soon. Yeah, notification bell. Subscribe. Bye for now. Okay, guys. First one is... Um, Oops, there we go. 20.8 carat. Now, you've seen this one before, but I thought I'd deal with this camera phone to show you way better of what the stone actually looks like. There it is. I've got a bit of crud on the surface, see? The blue one. Okay, there it is. Okay, now we'll have a look inside it. Okay, this one's $510. Delivery within Australia. Okay, that's it there. Okay, that's it on the cross table. Right. As you can see, it's got a bit of crap here that all has to come off, and it's got a slight bit of silk in it. The stone. But it has got a good piece inside it. As you can see, I think this is all not too crash hot but all this up is really good it's got a beautiful stone in it waiting to be revealed by the cutter okay guys that's 510 bucks delivered in australia registered post no insurance okay overseas different price tag okay next one is a 9.65 carat blue 600 dollars 13 by 10 by 9 millimeter. Now this is a, a bit better quality, as you will see. Okay, there's the stone there. That's it there. There's no internal fractures or cracks. That's the stone. You'd be cutting it on the cross, sort of in between cross and table, okay, because that's the, oops, there's the crystal head, okay, and my suggestion would be cutting it across this way to utilize the most out of the stone because it's light, it shouldn't have an issue, okay, look. So that's that that's what I would call table right there. I think that looks pretty good. Okay, there's see so there's a couple little tiny little cracks on the surface there. And just penetrate just a little tiny bit. But that that's nothing to definitely nothing to worry about. Okay. So yeah, that's six hundred bucks. Um yeah, including Delivery within Australia, overseas, 25 bucks. Not no insurance. So insurance is on top. Okay, guys. Yep, there she is. Beautiful. Bloody beautiful. Okay. Straight out of my mind. Now, I'll show you something different. Over here. This is a cut stone. Oops. It is. Now we'll do that, I think. Is it going to clear up? There it is. There she goes. Okay. Now this is... um. 
Okay. Again, it, it, this light does not show what actually it glows like. This is glowing. To me, it's really golden yellow here, but it doesn't look very yellow there at all. Okay. Let's see what that does. Okay. Now this is a two carat cut. It's um yeah. Beautiful stand. Flawless. Two point zero five carat. And that is a total of three thousand dollars. One thousand five hundred bucks per carat. It is absolutely gorgeous. Cut by Neville, the guy on the videos earlier on, right at the beginning. Yeah, did an excellent job. All right, guys, that's it. We'll leave it at that. Now we go. Like, share, subscribe. Bye for now, and God bless. <laughs>